Hello, my name is Ralf Orschau from Fitech in Germany and I would like to introduce you our solutions for embedded imaging. Here we see our new sensor board. It comes with a 5 megapixel um, MIPI camera sensor board and you can connect it easily to our platforms like i.mx8 and i.mx6. So it's very easy for you to integrate imaging into your product. And you do a whole range of sensors, all kinds of resolutions. It goes from WVGA, 1, 1 1.3 megapixel. And this one is a 5 megapixel. This is a 5 megapixel, you're right. And it is all sensors we choose are um, industrial grade. That means long availability. And also in terms of um, temperature range, we have industrial temperature range available. Is it like Sony sensors or different suppliers? Uh, who's making the best that you use? We have uh, Onzemi as a big partner from us. And um, yeah, and we are able to offer also other um, sensor suppliers because we have a um, uh, interface where you can easily connect these sensors to our platforms. So it's possible to go the parallel interface, short distance, and we have also FICAM S, which is a serial interface, LVDS, so it's, uh, you can um, have longer distance between the camera and the system on module. And new is uh, MIPI CSI interface, FICAM M, because most of the new processors have a MIPI interface, so um, that's the uh, solution for SOMs like i.mx8. So there's always like the sensor side, and what is this showing with the camera? Right, we have um, uh, the sensors, sensor boards, and we, you can connect different ob objectives onto the sensor. That means we have this M12 thing, we, as Fitech, we also offer um, uh, to build these cameras in-house. We have our own production for that. Is it like showing right here? Uh, right, that's a good overview about the uh, lenses. And um, uh, yeah, we offer customers to build them in-house. And you can also connect, as you can see, imagine there you can also connect a CS mount objective, which has a much better quality. And um, uh, I'm afraid we don't have that here. <laughs> okay. But there's a catalog about your imaging, right? Uh, Do people also buy your imaging solutions with other boards, or are they always compare with your boards? It's um, it's an open standard, so we also have. Uh, people buying the cameras using other suppliers for some that's right but uh, mainly because the software it's not only the hardware also the software is integrated in our Linux board support packages so it's um, yeah easy to use them combined with our system on modules ah, yeah there you have the uh, there you can see that you can mount on a, a M12 but it's also possible to uh, mount uh, other uh, objectives to the sensors. Uh, and there's special considerations about the embedded cameras. What kind of uh, use case are very uh, mm -hmm. popular? Popular is for example medical use case. We have uh, projects where uh, automatically um, sens uh, so the probes of blood or whatever can be tested so it's going automatically. We have uh, data matrix, matrix code recognition. We have um, in, in wind turbines, our hardware is included to measure the, uh, wind, the how much the wind it is and things like that. So uh, you, you, can, <coughs> you can find uh, embedded imaging uh, in a, a lot of applications, right? And also with AI, you might do more and more with this now. Because you could true, use yeah. it as a sensor for all kinds of stuff. Right, yeah. yeah. And we have plans to make boards with, uh, where we have um, uh, embedded imaging combined with AI, as you said before.
So um, then you can make um, uh, uh, face recognition and uh, several other things. Yeah. And you've been doing this for a long time already, the imaging, and is it special in the embedded world to be uh, specialized in this field? Yes, we have uh, our um, uh, department who is doing that is more than 20 years on the market, knowledge more than 20 years. We're starting with, let's say, with grabbers. But now because since 10 years, uh, um, the chip suppliers integrated camera um, interfaces into their chips and we use it to build low-cost uh, image processing solutions. So it's low-cost, it's not expensive. It's not expensive because you don't need a PC or x86 hardware. You can use it with a, um, a price-optimized um, ARM-based solution. And there's no need to have like a 20 megapixel, 40 megapixel, 100 megapixel? From our point of view, not, no. There might be a, um, a project where this is needed, but most of them, um, they don't. Five megapixel is already a lot for this industry. Right, yeah, I think so, yeah. We have a lot of projects where one megapixel or two is a fair enough. Yeah. So this is the kit that you have? Right, this is a starter kit. You can easily start your image processing uh, project with a kit from us. We have here uh, the iDotMX 8M processor combined with a MIPI camera. And you can get the kit completely and start your software development. Um, we have integrated the uh, video for Linux drivers into our board support package, so it's easy to start your um, application with this uh, hard and software from us. With the video for Linux, it, it accelerates uh, the playback and the recording, or it's, it's like a, a codec optimization for the chipset? It's a standard driver to, to grab imaging uh, um, pictures into, the, uh, into your application. And uh, it's affordable to buy one of these kits, or people can just buy it on your website? You can buy it in, at our website, we have a, a web shop, right? Or just contact us. <laughs>